Okay, in the last video we took a look at glitching an image with some text on it. And that's an okay effect, but what if we want to actually glitch the text itself? And this is pretty easy. We're going to grab some text, drop it on the screen. I'll move this out for you. I'm going to double click it. I'm going to go in here and I'm going to pick something different. I guess I'll go with the yellow to make it a little bit where you can see it more. And whatever text you got. Hit my space to center it. Probably back it up one. Expand this. Okay, now we're gonna hit OK, and now we got our text. Now I'm gonna go to FX. I'm gonna type glitch in here, and there's our glitch. I'm gonna put this down here on here, and I'm gonna expand this out. And now I'm gonna hit play. And you'll notice my text is moving back and forth. It's kicking. Um, you might like this glitch effect a little bit better. Throw some sound in it. And you've got a cool effect. Now what you can do is when you click on this. Click on modify. And you got a whole bunch of choices you can go here. And you click on help and it describes every one of these. If you want. So, the block size 64 I do like. The shift pattern's moving a little bit back and forth. Now, you don't want to make it this long. I mean, if you want to give it that look you're looking for. Let me put it there. Move this one back. Go back. Now, if I could time my glitch effect, might be a little bit better. Glitch duration, how long I want the glitch to happen for. Intensity, glitch interval. Could turn it down a little bit. Trigger mode, duration mode. Add more blocks. But I want it to dance. Um, wonder what that does. Hit play. What if I move this up more? Yeah, it's dancing a little bit faster. There's my jitter. Go back. And you just sit here and play with these glitches and you'll get them a lot quicker and you can really get what you're looking for. It's got enabled shake. If we want to take the shake off, we can. Whoops, take the check mark out. Not too bad. So we could go crazy block shifts. There's some choices here where it automatically does everything. See, it gets nuts. And then we could go or shift through lines you might like that one a little bit better because there is a drop down box there where we can make a whole bunch of choices so you'll probably play with the drop down box a lot quicker than trying to mess with the controls yourself it does make things a lot easier extreme so there you go see 
So if you're looking to um, glitch your text, then there you go. Now all you're going to do with this is you're going to produce it, save this video file, and then before you do your videos, you'll put this one first, then your video second, and then you'll have that. So this is how you glitch text in PowerDirector 18. Catch you guys on the next one.